MMA Boxing Talk. Breaking news. Cody Garbrandt versus TJ Dillashaw will be taking place. We're not sure about the date yet, but what we are sure about is that Garbrandt and Dillashaw will be going into the Ultimate Fighter house. Both of them are going to be coaches. The season's going to be called Redemption. It's going to be Garbrandt. It's going to be Dillashaw. There's bad blood. Alpha team. They were both Alpha team members. And of course, Dillashaw, you know, turned his back. Ended up really selling out, um, obviously, for a lot of money and, and financial, you know, stability, which it's hard to blame him. But Alpha Male did build TJ Dillashaw. So anyway, a lot of, lot of bad blood. Great storyline. Amazing fight. I mean, this is a fight that I wanted to see happen because Garbrandt, you know, I like that he's looking for, you know, a fight with Aldo or, or maybe with Gregor. I like the Aldo fight. Um, but Dillashaw is the fight to make. You know, everyone knows that. To be quite honest, I was saying it even before, um, you know, Garbrandt won the title. Dillashaw should have been getting that shot Garbrandt got. You know, he should have got a rematch with Cruz, but he didn't. But now Dillashaw has his chance. Awesome. I love it. I love it. You know, and I'm not a huge fan of the Ultimate Fighter show. You know, obviously it lost its flavor. It's lost it's lost its appeal over the years, but this is, you know, this is gonna be a season that's gonna be very, very interesting. I think the hardcore fans are gonna be watching. Um, I think the ratings will do better than no, than what it, what it's been doing lately. Um, but you know, I'll be tuning in for sure. Um I mean, yeah, no doubt. This is huge. Um, so I'm not really sure when they're actually going to fight. You know, of course, April 19th is when the show is going to start airing on TV. Um, so that's not for a while. You know, they're not going to fight till about, I'm going to say, till till the summer. You know, they're going to probably fight in, uh, it'll probably be, you know, UFC International Fight Week. Um, it'll be the first weekend of July. That's my guess. Um, let me know what you guys think about this fight. I mean, this is a great matchup. I, I, I mean, it's the one to make, you know. It's the best matchup, I think, in Bantamweight history. You know, that's just my opinion. I really do believe that. You know, before this one, I would say that Dillashaw Cruz was the best matchup in Bantamweight history. And now, I think this is this is the one. Dillashaw, you know, Garbrandt, Dillashaw, this is the one. I'm so stoked for this. I saw a rumor a couple hours ago while I was watching the football game. And um, I was like, oh my goodness. You know, that'd be great. But not sure. You know, just a rumor. And sure enough, I'm watching uh, UFC Fight Night 103. And uh, John Anik breaks the news between fights. Awesome. Awesome news. I'm so fucking pumped for this. Let me know what you guys think. I had to put out a little video talking about this fight. But this is something I believe that will really get the hardcore fans stoked. And, I mean, at the end of the day, it's not going to hurt Dillashaw or Garbrandt for their, um, you know, their notor notoriety. You know, it's going to help them become a little bit pop more popular. might gain them a couple extra fans. Um, especially Dillashaw. You know, he needs those extra fans. And uh, it'll help them, I think, sell the pay-per-view, of course. You know, obviously... How can that not sell the pay-per-view? They're going to have so many sound bites. The promo is going to be, you know, amazing. They already have a great promo. Add in all the shit that's going to go down at the Ultimate Fighter House. It's going to be great. I just hope neither guy really doesn't get out of character too much, you know. We'll see what happens. It's, it's going to be. Dillashaw, we know, is a bad trash talker. He's probably thinking, holy fuck. Dillashaw's probably writing lines down right now. Uh, you know, comebacks during the show because... Mind you, I mean, Garbrandt's not going to make him look silly like Dominic Cruz did. So, it's going to be a great back and forth season. I cannot wait. Let me know what you guys think. That's it for this one. Peace.